high school would come and play the black schools and the gymnasium and and so this oh, so was a gradual thing. Yeah. Right. So you guys have any questions about um, the historical black colored school here and any questions for Mr. Brown at at this site? Anybody have anything? Yep, he's got a question, got a question there. Yes. So did you ever go to school when it was mixed together? No, 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 no. I, I came up in the same graded area. I didn't have uh, only blacks. I went to Con I went here, same again, and then we went we were bust to Conway for when I was about I, in the fifties, sixties, and early seventies. The students were bust to Conway. You know what Conway is, and so we had a bus every morning. We had a little old Chevrolet bus about this size here, a little about thirty six passenger, and every day it didn't have a heater. Wow. It was cold. It was a cold yeah. ride, 14, miles. And a hot summer. ride in the summer. Yeah. <laughs> uh, you got a, a question right yes, here for okay. this young man. Got one. Which? Oh, right you? here. Okay. Were there any Hispanics or Puerto Ricans? Back no, then? not not in those days. Now let me say this about that because you've had Hispanics here. They would come here with the music. Uh, back in the day, fifties, you had calypso music, and they would play the calypso music at the hotels, o Ocean Forest, and, and uh, there was a rich culture. They provided the entertainment, but so far as the students, we only the professional musicians. I ran into some of those, but they weren't uh, didn't have a thriving uh, community not then, as it is now. 